the Sonic Temple album, I mean, although it's still a very diverse record compared to what the rest of the rock community are doing, I still think we were guilty of pandering towards commerciality. Um, that, was more, that was more of a subconscious thing. It just came out because that was the dominant thing that was around us. You can't, if you're open to what you're doing musically, you can't help but be affected by what's happening around you. And I think one of the things is you have to learn how to change yourself and what's happening around you at the same time. I mean, I believe in what I'm doing, and I think that if you compromise constantly, you have to pay the price, you know? And a lot of people are prepared to compromise all the way down the line, and, and they get all the toys and the goodies around them, but at the same time, you know, is that really what you're in it for in the first place? I mean, how much money do you actually need in your life? Yeah. And what are you going to do with it? You're going to take it with you when you go? I mean, the time that we all have is a time right now on Earth. It's right now. It's the gift of being alive. And so what? You've got eight BMWs. Who cares? You know? What are you going to do? Live in them? censorship when you actually physically get out there with the media and you get out there with the audience and you put your money where your mouth is so to speak and it's prepared to stand naked in the forest and say okay i have a point of view um put the idea around and obviously enough people came together and said yeah this is something you know that we all feel that there is that create you know there's so much apathy around that we've got to shake it up again you know got to shake the foundations and redefine everything i know what we all get out of it is quality of life meet new people, have new conversations, get into new relationships, redefine art forms, you know, creatively things go up. People think it's like some kind of trite hippie garbage when we talk about the earth, you know, they're very wrong, you know, because eventually you go back to the earth, you know, you are what you're going to become, which is the soil and the trees, and that's it. And when you're aware of that, then your quality of life just goes up. And we all have a choice as well. Everyone has the choice to make, it's up to them. If you want to be one of the scaredy cats running around with the rest of the pack going, yeah, well, I agree with what everyone's saying, I'm a yes man. Or you can just stand up and be yourself.